Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. It's a theremin for the iPhone. It's the thereminator. If you search for the word theremin in the iTunes App Store, you'll be able to pull it up. And the reason why I'm not showing it, uh, the uh, thereminator up close is because uh, <clears throat> it's butt ugly. But it obviously sounds good. And you just simply drag your finger across the field designated. And you have a theremin. Or at least the closest thing that you could likely get to a theremin on the iPhone. You can change wavelengths. Tremolo. You can go reset to the default value. So if you, you know, need to create your own sound effects, you can. Have you heard the, uh, the guy who can play the Legend of Zelda theme on the theremin? Amazing. Find the video on YouTube. I am obviously not that skilled. You've got a few sliders here that you can adjust to change the sound. Honestly, it's all about touch. And of course, you know, the output of audio. Without that, you really don't have much of a, a musical instrument. And yes, the theremin is considered a musical instrument. Does that mean I'm playing a musical instrument? Well, I'm playing it, but that doesn't mean I'm making music. Actually, it's more that I'm playing with it, not necessarily playing it. I'm having fun. Although I would beg the developer to just work on the interface a tiny bit, just a tiny bit. And I saw the screenshots. I knew what I was getting into. I did. And it cost $3 in the App Store. Still, I spent the money. Why? Because I love iPhone apps that create sound. You want me to buy an iPhone app? Let me have fun like this. Let's change it to... It's almost like a fly. I could sit here for the next four hours and do nothing but this. And I likely will. Uh, the Thereminator. Thereminator. Thereminator? Find it. Three dollars, at least at this point in time. And, uh, I apologize in advance for the state of the UI. My email address is chris at perilla.com. Maybe you know of an iPhone app that I have not yet seen. By the way, uh, you can also send iTunes gift certificates along to me if you'd like me to try out more apps that are going to cost me money so I can tell you whether or not they're worth the money. <clears throat> just saying, it's, it's nice to have donations every once in a while. You also are welcome to stop by our community website at geeks.perilla.com if you want to participate in conversations and threads and make blog posts and post videos, embed your own YouTube videos, upload photos, audio, you name it, you can likely do it at geeks.perilla.com. And of course, you're also welcome to stop by my blog at chris.perilla.com. And then if you've got nothing else better to do with your time, you're welcome to hang out with the geeks live. Uh, see in this chat room here, it's tied into this live video feed that's being broadcast out over the internet 24 hours a day, 7 days a week at live.perillo. Oh, my iPhone shut off. Dot com. We'll see you later.